<sighs> okay, Cancer. Okay, Cancer, Sun, Moon, Rising, and the North Node. This is your reading. So, funny enough, <laughs> I actually wasn't even going to do you guys' reading. Sorry, no offense. But, um, I don't know, I just wasn't. So, that could be an omen. I, I'm getting there could be something important or something that you consider to be important that you're not doing all right but I'm getting like don't do anything like if you're not feeling like it or if you're not in the mood okay because I'm getting like your your intuition is like um in combination with your moods all right I'm also hearing like bipolar disorder but that is literally cancer you guys switch with the moons like every two days so I'm getting like you could be in some type of um getting like a bad mood but i'm getting like you're coming out of some type of funk all right but i'm also getting like you're really working on your heart chakra so i'm also hearing like heart palpations okay so you could be like having like your heart is like beating like irregularly um this could also be um anything involving like breathing problems even like you i'm hearing heart stroke heat stroke like feeling like this so i'm getting you guys could be going through a spiritual awakening but i'm getting like intensifying energies because of the new moon or because of the shift in the moon all right or because of the shift in the um planetary bodies all right so um your reading is titled 69 your body is a temple now i might change it but i'm definitely getting that so the 69 card of course this is your guys number this represents yin and yang all right so i'm getting you could think that someone your, your um your other half or someone like kind of mirrors you very well all right i'm also getting this is like um mainly for cancer moon and other higher aspected placements of course if you're a cancer sun this is your reading by nature all right so yeah i'm also getting like um there's something that you're getting or something that you're owed all right i'm getting like you're gonna get it because it's like a part of your nature it's just something that you're supposed to be getting funny enough i'm getting like a package mail something like that something that you're waiting for you may think that you're you're not gonna get it but i'm getting you are okay so there's three cards that were like missing out of the deck and we have the five of pentacles being at lack but i'm hearing like um a financial change over the next five days literally getting that or the next five months but i'm really getting this is like kind of like faster type of energy Energy. and then we have the king of pentacles so someone going from like five of pentacles to the king of pentacles damn near rags to riches all right i'm getting um cancer um leo cusps okay or just cancer leo this could also be a couple dynamic here but i'm getting you and someone else are very dynamic i'm also hearing criminal minds all right I'm hearing something about television, television shows, all right, um, CNN, STN. I'm also hearing, um, hearing something about ends, ends, all right. Um, so I'm also hearing inception. So I'm getting an idea that someone's going to basically implant in your mind or like give you an idea like in the next five days. I'm also hearing something about May is very significant. You're going to be meeting a lot of like millionaires, all right. I don't know why I'm hearing trillionaires. That's is that even a thing? All right. So, oh, I'm doing it wrong. <laughs> so, Cancer, we're gonna pull the embodiments that you're dealing with for the next week. So, for Cancer, February 14th through, by the way, Happy Valentine's Day through the 14th through the 24th, important messages or embodiments that they are dealing with. All right. So, the Temperance, you could be dealing with a grand trine or someone like I said, you and another person have the perfect blending of energies. Or whatever you're doing, you feel very good doing it. Okay. But Sagittarius energy here, we have the Empress here. All right. Um, this could be a paternal figure. This could also be um a, a mother figure or um someone that you have a child with. Or this could be literally a, a divine counterpart. Okay. Um, I'm hearing a wife. All right. So the Empress is here. Libra, Taurus, Virgo. All right. We have the Sun card. So I'm getting like your wife or um someone that you're with. Your spouse may be pregnant. Okay. It could be um a Sagittarius or this could just be what you're wanting. All right. And then we have the Judgment. So yeah, I'm getting you're being called to breed with someone. Okay this empress i'm getting like heavy on the fire or heavy on the hots okay yeah the strength card so i'm definitely getting this could be someone who's resisting you or i'm hearing resistance all right so let's see so for cancer sun moon rising and the north node over our energies for february 14th through the 24th so the next 10 days all right so i'm definitely getting a new beginning or a new start 
all right so yeah letting go you're letting go of one thing or one chapter in your life and then you're moving on to something else so i'm definitely getting with this four here i'm getting like your plans you're gonna have to let go of some type of plan that you had okay because i'm getting something's about to be orchestrated or something is about to change all right we have the listening the understanding and then the playful yeah someone could have told you to let go of someone okay or you you may have to understand why something wasn't the right time why you have to let go i'm also getting like you're going to have to let go of your immature ways especially if like you're having a child here yeah with the high priestess of earth I'm definitely getting virgo um taurus energy could be capricorn as well here but i'm definitely getting that i'm also getting like someone's going to have um i don't know why i'm hearing like a fire child here all right or a fire sign child i'm getting like um yeah all right so let's go ahead and get into it so for cancer sun moon rising and the North Node, important messages they're dealing with from February 14th through the 24th. For Cancer, Sun, Moon, Rising, and the North Node, important messages that they're dealing with from February 14th through the 24th. All right, so we have the Princess of Cups. So I'm definitely getting you could be dealing with someone younger than you or um, just a new connection here or something new. I'm getting like something is fresh here i'm also getting someone's like washing their hair i'm also getting like dandruff okay so i'm getting something about being fresh like fresh hair um fresh out the shower but yeah prince of wands five of cups and the four of pinnacles so i'm getting you could have asked someone if they wanted to have sex or maybe you were initiating this or you, this is where you were getting to but i'm getting like someone's starting to hold back yeah eight of wands definitely getting communication texting all right what's the princess of cups Yep, the Queen of Swords, one more, and then the Strength card. I'm also getting, like, someone that you're trying to come at or someone that you may think, you may think that someone's, like, a little foolish or immature, but I'm getting, like, they're not. There's actually the Queen of Swords here. All right, yeah, Judgment. Okay, so I'm definitely getting someone could have called you out or someone could have blocked you. But, yeah, I'm getting, like, someone's holding back or they're, like, they don't want to do something. What's the Prince of Wands? I'm also getting like someone's only reaching out to you or something to be malicious or to getting like to get some type of information out of you but i'm getting like whatever someone's telling you it's not what i'm getting something isn't what it seems yeah seven of pentacles the magician and then the ten of cups and yeah, i'm getting like someone was so happy because they thought that they were manipulating you all right but i'm getting like nah i'm getting like you're cutting them off or like you feel like someone's childish what's the five of cups All right, too many. What's the five of cups? Yep, the devil. So I'm definitely getting like, here's your energy as well. But I'm getting like, there's someone that's like pretty much sad because you don't want to initiate or go along with some type of plan that they have. What's the prince of cups and the queen of swords? Or because you're being very cutthroat, cold. I'm also hearing examinations. All right, yeah, the, the emperor. So this could be an Aries or a Capricorn reaching out to you. Also getting Libra heavily. All right. So, but I'm getting like you're very tempered. What's the Queen of Swords? One more. Yeah. Yeah, I'm getting like this person. If you're trying to like stop someone from doing something or hold someone back in any type of way, they're just going to leave. I'm getting like this person. They don't like that. What's the Princess of Wands? Yeah, the Ten of Wands, the Two of Swords, and then the Ace of Pentacles. Yeah. But other than that, I'm getting like you're going to be working or meeting with this entrepreneur or Capricorn. I'm getting like somebody who's extremely successful here. or This is your energy. All right. But I'm getting like you're manifesting a lot of money. This could also be gambling. I don't know. I'm hearing that. Forex, investing, stocks, whatever. What's the Ten of Cups? Yeah, the Five of Swords. Yeah. I'm getting like you were sad. Like if you were sad or something, I'm also getting like someone here is like they're like they're wanting you to like exp explain like how you feel or like you're coming to someone and you're like sad or whatever. But like someone's like like laughing at your sadness or something. Yeah, I'm getting divine intervention because I'm getting like someone that you're talking to. I'm getting like they actually they're jealous or envious of you, of your happiness, of what you get or like even your North Nose, the Five of Cups. Yeah, Nine of Swords. Um, ten of swords and then the seven of wands yeah i'm getting like someone's whole plan i'm getting like something was only gonna last for like four to five months max and then someone was going to reject you or someone was going to tell i don't know a whole bunch of lies on you all right i'm getting like it's an aries or it's someone i'm getting someone's coming off extremely obsessive or i don't know but what's the emperor and the four of wands yeah the queen of pentacles the justice 
and then the seven of cups yeah i'm also getting like someone they could be like they want to be in a relationship with you but i'm getting like if you have your own business like i'm getting like someone may try to embarrass you or downplay you so then they can look like the superior i'm getting something about superior or supreme <sighs> All right, one more. Yeah, the Eight of Wands. Other than that, I see a lot of people coming towards you. I see you traveling a lot, meeting a lot of people, even if you're not traveling. I'm also getting like um the weather is changing or it's getting more cold. All right, with the swords here. What's the Two of Swords? Yeah, the Three of Pentacles, the Ten of Pentacles, the Ace of Wands, and then the Ace of Cups. Yeah, I'm getting someone who's extremely jealous of like what you have. The new, I'm getting you're getting like, I mean, I'm getting like three new connections here, and but there's like an air sign or. A fire sign some are mad what's the ten of swords you have six of wands and then okay but i'm definitely getting like you're changing here okay or i'm also getting you're ending multiple connections here but i'm getting like you're getting money here what's the queen of pentacles and the justice all right cancer i really don't even see your energy i see you actually seven of cups eight of cups you're kind of like leaving something that was confusing all right what's the queen of pentacles you have the sun card the judgment and then the seven of swords so 77 so i'm getting like you could have been trying to play someone or you could have been trying to do something all right because i'm getting like someone came back around and they're planning on coming to like reconcile with you but i'm getting like everything that someone's doing is like bullshit what's the eight of wands three of pentacles i'm also getting someone's like working in cahoots with like someone else or like a group of people all right yeah wheel of fortune i'm also getting like if someone invites you to a party um you may want to ask like who's gonna be there okay because i see like this capricorn inviting you to a party or someone just inviting to a party but i'm hearing something about like a lot of questions or i'm also hearing like a lot of stares a lot of different looks or a lot of um opinions here that's going to be there this actually reminds me of a, um, um, a dream i had all right hope i had when um it was basically like i was by myself and i was sitting in the car okay it was like months ago and i was smoking or i was just like having like this chill relaxing time right and um, i'm by myself right and then someone else comes and I had knew the people, okay, these could have been like, these are like people I have went to school with, but they were familiar faces. And they're like, hey, like you should come smoke with us or you should, you know, whoop de whoop. And at first something was telling me like, no, don't go with them because you know, I knew myself, like I knew that like when I'm around like other people and shit like that, like it doesn't be going good, all right? So something just told me like, nah, but I still went, right? And then in the dream, like once I got there, it was like a whole bunch of girls. Mind you, it was like when I had got there or when the people had asked me, it was only like two people. Like and even when we got in the car, it was like max, including like me and the two other people, like four people in the car, right? And so funny enough, when we got to <laughs> the place where we were gonna all be like smoking together, because mind you i told you they asked me to basically do the exact same thing that i was doing by myself but with them right and so i go there and all this shit just starts happening like the car breaks down and mind you i'm in my car but they like ask me they're like no you can come with us you can ride with us and i go with them and then their car breaks down and then i get there and then like everyone's just talking like all you hear is like a whole bunch of people talking and then like a whole bunch of slick ass comments like covert ass um compliments and like questions and shit like that like basically trying to put me on the spot and shit like that this reminds me of that so what i'm getting is someone's trying to put you on the spot or someone's trying to embarrass you yeah because i'm getting you're extremely um smart you're extremely intelligent someone wants to um combat that all right yeah the king of wands the king of cups the lovers the ace of swords and then the nine of pentacles yeah i'm getting like someone it could be multiple of your lovers here i'm getting they just want to i don't know i'm getting I don't know what's the ace of swords and the nine of pentacles but i'm getting you know the truth like you know you're supposed to be doing something independently here but i'm getting like there's going to be people who kind of try to come and confuse you all right i'm getting these are love options all right yeah okay what's the king of pentacles i mean what's the king of wands and the king of um cups yeah okay yeah, I'm getting like, I'm even getting like someone may actually leave you at the party or leave you hanging or like leave without you type shit. Yeah, but I'm getting like overall though, I, this could be one specific person. I'm getting like it's an Aries or it's an air sign, all right? Yeah, the three of wands. Yeah, the high priestess and then the three of cups. I'm also getting like someone is going to try to make you like, I'm just getting someone trying to do something malicious to you that's not going to work. Yeah, 
okay i'm also like i'm just getting that okay but other than that i'm getting like yeah you're connecting with this person they really match your energy okay or this is what you're planning on doing here and right, i'm just getting like you're a lot of people want to connect with you but there's one specific person that um they're trying to play you or, or something they're trying to play you with, like a group of people or some shit or i don't know yeah five of pentacles the eight of pentacles and then the four of cups all right but i'm getting like the crazy thing is the people that they're trying to play you with they actually all want to work with you secretly or some shit but i'm getting like yeah someone is your actual true love here you're going to be connected with someone here i'm getting like a real twin flame or your true love here okay it could be a water sign all right a water sign like yourself we have pisces here we have cancer here as well here getting two water signs yeah two of wands nine of wands the, the six of cups the temperance and the three of wands i'm also getting like yeah you want to talk to someone or you're realizing that like someone's your true love here but i'm getting there's someone in your mix here that's like concerned all right it could be a third party or it could just be like an ex all right i'm just getting like be weary of like who you go out with who you go to parties with shit like that all right, I'm going to pull um, some Oracle cards. I don't have my other cards for some reason. But yeah, Seven of Wands, like rejection. Someone wants to reject you. I'm getting it to Fire Sign. And this could be actually someone that you're with right now. I'm getting like someone just trying to make like a, a fool out of you or something. But I'm getting it's because a lot of people are attracted to you or a lot of people find you to be worth it. So I'm getting like this person, they want to like do something or outcast you. Okay. All right. So yeah, Eight of Pentacles, Four of Cups, Ten of Wands, and the Two of Swords, all right? But I'm getting like, overall, I'm getting like, yeah, you're thinking about someone like tremendously, okay? Like a lot, all right? I'm getting this Empress here, all right? There's an air sign around you that's extremely jealous of this person or jealous of your love for this person, all right? Yeah, yeah, I'm getting out of everyone, this person, they remain like your, your pick, all right? Yeah, I'm getting you love someone here. But here's the air sign again. <laughs> I'm also getting like, if you want to get someone, I'm getting like, be, I'm getting like professionalism or like, I'm also getting like love bombing. Someone's trying to love bomb you. All right, yeah. But I'm also getting like, what's the seven of cups? Yeah. All right, but other than that, I'm getting like people are low key fighting for you on some shit, or you, you, or you're fighting for this person, or if, whoever you want. I'm getting many other people want this person but yeah okay the emperor and the empress did come out here so i'm getting like yeah this is your spouse here but i'm getting like someone i'm getting be weary of this because i'm getting like yeah i'm getting like someone just really does not want you to be single all right so yeah getting you're dealing with a lot of different people but i'm getting this one person in specific i'm getting this person could have the same exact energy as you or if you're a water sign this person's a water sign here but i'm getting water moon so if you're a water sun someone else is a water moon and that's the person okay but i'm getting like the person that you're supposed to be with actually is like a water sign they're the same sign as you but the person is trying to like manipulate you or manipulate a situation they could be the same sign as you but in the moon sign or in vedic or something like that that's what i'm getting all right so overall energies for this reading all right yeah belonging in reverse yeah someone does not someone's going to try to outcast you so i'm getting like someone's going to invite you somewhere just to like outcast you or this is what they're going to try to do yeah the high priestess of air yeah reversed i'm getting like someone's basically trying to get people to look at you in a different way but yeah successful but i'm getting people still see you as successful regardless yeah honesty i'm getting like you don't even have to do anything people already know you're successful so i'm getting like someone's like hearing like you gave someone the privilege to like talk to you be with you whatever and they're going to try to embarrass you here yeah chaos a tower moment understanding and then letting go yeah i'm getting you're gonna understand you're, I'm, I'm also getting this could be someone that you let go of i'm getting you, you could have like not got closure or something but i'm getting someone who's trying to do real dirty behind the scenes or they're really trying to embarrass you and make you look like a bad person yeah conclusion so something ended or divine intervention again i'm getting like your angels are shielding you okay because i'm getting like you're focused on someone and someone else is like focused on trying to get you caught up like yeah cycles constantly over and over again i'm getting like for no reason yeah fragment it's like someone's trying to break down your character yeah a cancer i'm getting it's another cancer here or you're doing this to someone i'm getting an aries or something or this this person could be an entrepreneur you could be an entrepreneur i'm getting a man and a woman just period i'm getting if you're a woman this is a man doing this to you 
all right yeah the vision i'm getting <laughs> two very similar energies but yeah, i'm getting you're supposed to be with a pisces here i'm getting like your counterpart for the pisces yeah the forbidden but i'm getting like there's an aries or there's an air sign who doesn't want this to happen here all right but i'm getting yeah a new start in love for you all right i'm getting you could be single you could be celibate or this person they're single they're celibate whatever all right 